2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. Memories of the way we were. Yep, get ready, Jim. There's Jim. Jim Dryden starting now. to the 2010 string band division. This is the optimism of Overbrook. Happy days, the four-leaf clover, the spinning umbrellas, Jake. And they really sounded like an old-fashioned string band. You've heard all the instruments, and, and look at that cape. I mean, that's right out of the 1920s and 30s. Jimmy Dryden, terrific job. Yes, absolutely excellent job. Carmen Vitanza, you, you mentioned before, was a new musical director. Young Carmen Vitanza, he's the real Vitanza in my book, but I, that's, a, that's a personal joke with, with his family. But uh, you had Anthony Herner back on banjo this year, an excellent banjo player, too. Well, what a wonderful start, as I said. We've got Trilby in the wings waiting to come in. We also have someone right on the street right now we want to hear from, and our Jameson Euler is with the mayor. Jameson? 
Yeah, good afternoon, Steve. How are you? Uh, obviously, I'm here with Philadelphia Mayor Michael Nutter, who's joining us. Happy New Year, Mayor. Good to see you. Good, good to see you. you. How about the uh, first string band going by? What do you think of the Mummers so far? Mummers have been doing a great job. Uh, this wonderful tradition must continue, and uh, we're going to double and triple our efforts to make sure we never have to worry about the Mummers Day Parade on uh, New Year's Day ever again. Uh, but I'm very pleased, very proud, everyone. Has done a fantastic job. Great crowds out here today. The weather cooperated. It's a ball. I was going to say the weather when you walked outside. Didn't think you'd see the sunshine out here today. I was a little worried. Obviously, some of the some of the uh, some of your fans up here in the stands are saying, "Save the Mummers." How do you yes. make sure that this stays here every year? Well, uh, one, we're here today, and uh, I think the relationship has grown, uh, and uh, we will actually start in February of this year working toward January 1st of 2011. Uh, that's how much on top of this we're going to be. We're looking for sponsorships, working with the groups and organizations. We've figured out some different things that we can change uh, to reduce our costs. Uh, but overall, the partnership and the relationship has absolutely grown, and I'm very proud of everyone involved. Well, Mummers fans certainly love to hear that. Yeah. Mayor Michael Nutter, thank you for joining us. Happy New thank Year you. to you Happy New and Year your to family. You. Happy New Year to everyone. 2010 is going to be our time. There you go, 2010, everyone. We want to thank Comcast for the Comcast Mummers Parade. We're going to be right back after this message. Of all the holidays, this is the season of sharing, when even the smallest gesture can bring warmth to your heart. So in the spirit of giving, Hyundai is spreading a little extra comfort and joy. Buy a 2010 Sonata and you'll get 0% financing for up to 60 months and make no payments for 90 days. Plus, you'll get America's best warranty and Hyundai Assurance. See? You're not that hard to shop for. Get 0% financing for 60 months on the 2010 Sonata. Ends January 4th. The Comcast Mummers Parade is brought to you in part by Turkey Hill. Bottled cold, shipped cold, sold cold for cold fashion refreshments. Turkey Hill, America's number one refrigerated iced tea. The concert event that helped put the Mummers on Broad Street. Don't want to waste another day. Comcast presents the Bacon Brothers, A Night with the Mummers. Encore presentation today after the parade on MyPHL 17. The costumes, the music, the magic. The fancy brigades are back on MyPHL 17. Two hours, prime time from the Pennsylvania Convention Center. The Comcast Fancy Brigades tonight at 8, only on MyPHL 17. The Mummers Show of Shows, February 27th at Boardwalk Hall. Order tickets at Ticketmaster.com or call this number. For more info, visit PhillyMummers.com. Bottled cold, shipped cold, sold cold for cold fashion refreshments. Turkey Hill, America's number one refrigerated iced tea. And we're here at the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. I'm Steve Highsmith, along with Judge Jake Hart, and also with Mr. Ambassador Bob Shannon, former captain of Quaker City String Band. I think he's had a few wins. Let's see, if I recall, seven first prizes, 22 top three finishes as captain, and of course, leading the band to nine first prize places. That's uh, not a bad record. Uh, we'll live with that. Thank you all for being here. Uh, we have uh, Trilby coming up now with uh, Captain Joe Kaminsky, and they're going to do Trilby's La Vida Loca. And they are apparently starting now.
spicing up our lives on New Year's Day. It's the original Trilby String Band and Captain Joe Kaminsky. Boy, I tell you, that percussion at the beginning, I, I oh, thought yeah. that was great, the delayed yeah. entrance of the captain. Trilby's La Vida Loca, living the crazy life. And by the way, Joe Kaminsky, who was Carmen Miranda, is a big movie buff. You know, spent a lot of time watching old Carmen Miranda movies. <laughs> This year, he, remember last year, he changed from a, 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 a soda jerk into a greaser in front of the band? Uh -huh. right. This year, he had a sex change operation. <laughs> he went from Clement Miranda to a male dancer. It was a very nice but theme. They have they, two they are players. very They're a very young organization, they and they're they, trying to build what they know they can do and do well. And they're and, doing it well. And I think they are. And they're doing old-time yes. mummers. There was everyone with a back piece, two bell players, two violin players. Nice bass solo with the introduction to spice up your life. Uh, they work hard, and, and, and it's going to pay off. And Joe's a great guy. He works at Family Court. He helps make a lot of adoptions happen. He's another one of those great mummer stories there and a great family as well, and glad his daughter's feeling better as well. Let's uh, go out to Jameson Euler, who's out on the street right now. Jameson. Hey, Steve. I'm uh, joined here by singer-composer uh, Bunny Sigler, who is also part of the uh, Bacon Brothers uh, and their benefit concert that you guys put on a couple weeks ago. New Year's Day of the song we did. New Year's Day. Yeah. Very fitting, obviously, for today. Happy New Year, Bunny. And we all started out together at Shunk Street, walking Kevin and his Michael. Kevin left for Spruce, and Michael had to bail out at the Union League. He was cold. I'm not cold. <laughs> you got a nice jacket on yeah, today, I'm, Bunny. I'm hey, ready. you obviously uh, have some uh, long credentials in that, uh, and, and very well good credentials in that uh, resume of yours. You, you've written songs for people like? Patti LaBelle, the OJs, um, Gladys Knight and the Pips, Jay-Z, uh, Nelly and Kelly, and... Uh, Jay-Z, Nelly, I mean, you're still going strong these Chaka days. Chaka Khan. Chaka Khan <laughs> as, yeah, well, so. as well. Hey, how about the turnout today? Oh, this is fantastic. This is, and the weather. I'm glad we had a break with the weather. And the concert that was a couple weeks ago, it's actually going to be airing on my PHL right after the... Uh, right after the parade. parade They're going to show the concert that we had from the electric factory. It was a great time out there. And I was saying, come on, baby, let the good time roll. Oh, yeah. yeah. So that was a good crowd that showed up that day. How about the support for the Mummers and the oh, Save the Mummers .com? really great. I mean, that's, a, that's what we're here for. And Kevin and his brother, really, they started it, and they brought me in on it, and uh, I'm glad. But just, you know, I'm really happy to have been walking down Broad Street. I've already always been on one side or the other, but to be coming down the Main Street, Oh, them golden slippers. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bunny, we appreciate it. We appreciate your fundraising efforts for the Mummers as well. Okay. Thank you for joining us, and Happy New Year Thank to you. Thank you. We'll have more of the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade coming right up after this break. Doesn't this look good? Enter to win a $2,000 tropical vacation by voting in the Mummers Viewers' Choice polls. Who's the best string band? The Fanciest Fancy Brigade. Text the name to 38807 or log on to myphl17.com slash vote. They get the bragging rights, you get the trip. The Comcast Mummers Parade Viewers' Choice Poll. Deadline for entry Sunday at midnight. They're all that stands. This quest is bigger than any of us. Between the living and the living dead. Sunday at 8 on MyPHL17. Here. I wouldn't miss it. Chunked it. Are you kidding me? You have your holiday traditions. We have ours. See your Honda dealer today for special leasing or low financing on a new Honda. I'm Justin Beta, communications tech at Comcast, and we're proud to salute the troops and present their holiday greetings to friends and family back home. Hi, this is Major George Mount in Afghanistan, saying happy holidays to the Mount family back in Pennsylvania. Love you guys. I also want to say Merry Christmas and Happy New Year to my wife, Kristen. Hope to see you soon. For more troop greetings, check out the Get Local section of Comcast On Demand or watch them on Comcast.net. On behalf of all of us at Comcast, Happy New Year. And this is the Peter A. Brumall String Band, Brumall's Barnyard Bash with Captain Peter J. Brumall Sr. They're starting now.
Wow. You know, I had a good opportunity to... Okay. Well... That's something. I want to tell you, I've, I've never seen in recent years Pete Broomall as good as that. I, I've rarely seen captains really as good was. as that. And, and that those was... dancers, I had a chance to wear the turkey head at a rehearsal. Denise Boyd's wearing that one. You can't, and that's really hard to do anything with heads that big. And what I like about the way they played, they have a small horn section, but they kept them together as a unit, so they sounded larger and they sounded better. And James Brewball, Pete's father, 84 years old, still playing the violin in the band. Yep. Well, I mean, talk about old Pete Brewmall had a farm. I mean, I, I, I am just still, I am so impressed with Pete's performance as a captain. I think yeah, any was. captain out yep. there on the street today will be, we, he was active, he played the banjo, he mm -hmm. moved around a lot of different ways, he was funny, he put the Brewmall brand on it. Bob, yep. I thought that was great. And the, like and the that boy, part. And the Boyd, the Boyd family came through real, real big. Uh, Denise uh, was the turkey. And uh, Denise Marie was uh, one of the uh, one of the dancers. The dancers the, right there, right. and um, Denise, Denise Marie, you did an absolutely excellent job. Well, I'm, Broomall has, has elevated its game greatly, mm -hmm. and everybody, I think that was a fine performance, and it's just continued. It's at a high level already. And we want to remind you, folks, that if you like what you've seen so far, or you like in particular someone else that's coming up, you get a chance to put your two cents worth in. The 2010 Viewers' Choice poll will take place, and. You get two opportunities, really. You can do it for the string bands, or you could do it for the fancy brigades. You can do it by going to myphl17.com or by texting, as you saw. Now, the polls will open at 5 for the string bands. For the fancy brigades, they'll open at 8 o'clock. They'll be open for a couple of days, and you're automatically entered to win a $2,000 tropical vacation. But we're going to have more of the string bands, of course, coming our way. We have Irish-American string band moving into position. And this is the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. We're live here at City Hall, downtown Philadelphia. We will be right back. Let it snow. Let it snow. Let it sleep, freeze, rain, and then let it snow again. Stabilitrack Stability Enhancement. Traction control, plus a five-star crash safety rating. GMC Acadia. Now during the GMC Holiday Event, you can lease a 2010 GMC Acadia for $349 per month. See dealer for details. Visit GMCSuperDeals.com. Starting now, I'm going to bring some fiscal sanity to our world. I'm going to find ways to spend less and save more. Starting now, I'm going to figure out what's ahead before I get there. All the guidance and resources you need to do the right thing financially. Make the switch. Starting now. Beneficial Bank. Starting now, I'm going to reach for higher places. For a copy of the Philadelphia String Band Association performances, send a check or money order to this address. For more info, log on to fillingmummers.com. This year, MyPHL17 has one goal. I'm saving television, Lois. Because Family Guy is stronger than ever. Check out my bulging rippliness. Peter, you've been to the gym once for 15 minutes. Get tough in 2010 with Family Guy. Weeknights at 7.30 and 11 on MyPHL 17. For Detective Adrian Monk, there is no case he can't solve and no surface he won't clean. <laughs> Monk, Sunday at 9 on MyPHL 17. And we're back on the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade, and you might see a couple folks in there eating ice cream. Uh, the Turkey Hill ice cream was passed out to some people here, and it's, it's that kind of day. You can eat ice cream. It's actually not too bad out there. And you can eat Turkey Hill ice cream anytime, of course. This is Irish American String Band, Kelly Mann, Wasting Away in Mummeritaville, starting now.
right there. Surfboard back pieces. That's Captain Kelly Marie Elizabeth Mann and Irish American String Band wasting away in Mamaritaville. There's, okay. the, there's one of the first uh, candidates for our Custard's Last Stand Best Theme <laughs> title. Wasting away in Mamaritaville. Kelly Mann in her 10th year as captain. She's up near the top in seniority all of a sudden because of so many new captains. I like that little band. They have they had men dressed as women with coconut bras, even though they have a <laughs> women in the band. But they still did it that way. They also the only band with not one but two bass clarinet players. Uh, uh, Kelly said it was going to be fun, and Bob, she's all about that. They celebrated their 10th anniversary last year as a band. It's really good. Absolutely, and and she and she was always the one that used to say to me and Billy Bowen, "Bring it on." Yep. She would she would never step back and, and step down from a from a challenge. And I'll tell you right now, she she's. Uh, very proud of what she did, and uh, I think they're, they're they're doing real well. They're starting to build themselves back in there to where they want to be. Well, to John Cates and Kathy and Megan Livingston and Caitlin and everybody else, great job with Irish American. We have more of the 2010 parade, of course, coming up. However, uh, I do want to make quick mention. We want to thank Comcast for its participation, for its support, for making this parade happen so that you could see it, enjoy it at home. 58 stories. Nearly a thousand feet tall, the tallest building in Philadelphia, 15th tallest building in the U.S., the Comcast Tower. This is the Comcast Mummers Parade on my PHL 17. More to come in the string band. Stay tuned. Happy New Year. Comcast Mummers Parade is brought to you in part by your Tri-State Toyota dealers. Time's running out on Toyotathon, our biggest event of the year. <laughs> Hurry in for amazing deals on a huge selection of your favorite Toyota models. And right now at your neighborhood Toyota dealer, you can lease the always reliable new 2010 Toyota Camry for just $179 a month. Or choose the Toyota Corolla. Now you can lease a sporty new 2010 Corolla for an amazingly low $149 a month. It's not just an event, it's Toyotathon. On now through January 4th. Comcast brings Philadelphia the fastest 4G wireless network. 4G for faster shopping sprees, faster play-by-play -play updates, or something delicious, faster. 4G for faster presentation changes, faster work sessions, or meeting face-to-face -face faster. The company that brought you the fast home and office now brings you fast on the go with the fastest 4G wireless network. The 2010 Mummer Show of Shows. One day only, two shows. And it all happens at the Atlantic City Boardwalk Hall, Saturday, February 27th at noon at 5 p.m. To order tickets, call 1-800-736-1420 or online at Ticketmaster.com. Special rates available for groups of 15 or more. It's the award-winning performances of the Philadelphia String Band Association, the 2010 Mummers Show of Shows. And don't forget, for all Mummers info, log on to PhillyMummers.com. And we're back. This is the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. You're looking at Center City, Philadelphia from high atop City Hall. And we've got Aqua Spring Band standing by, Ron Iacone, and their theme, It's About Time. And they are starting now.
gorgeous. Great. Absolutely gorgeous. What time is it? Does anybody know what time it is? It is Aqua Time celebrating their 90th year. Captain Ron Ancone, wonderful job. They were terrific. And you know, when I talked to Ron, I said, how are you going to find songs about clocks? He said, songs, we've got millions of them. And they found <laughs> stuff like the, the, the theme from Jeopardy with that wonderful black cat. Everyone's grandmother oh, had one of them true. hanging up. They, they all, and their rhythm section is very good because it's made them always sound like a ticking clock. Very strong rhythm and section. And he said it, he said, you know, the same thing to me, Jake. And he said the hard part was not finding what songs for it, but which ones to leave out. Yes, that's oh, yeah. true. And they, they chose well, they executed well. They should be very, very proud of that. Very proud. Boy, I tell you, yeah. uh, this is a, the point when the judges usually take a break just to make sure they fairly judge the first five bands. You know, most people don't like being one of the early ones to be judged in anything. And so they're going to do that. I want to take this opportunity to thank you, Captain. Thank for you, stopping sir. by here, Mr. Ambassador you, Bob Shannon. Thank, thank you, you very, sir. very thank much. You. Uh, final you, comment from you on Aqua. Uh, outstanding. Uh, Patrick Farrell is a, a dear friend of ours. Uh, he's he's a drill master. He really does a great job. And Kai Reed uh, is now a little down on himself, uh, sick, and uh, but uh, he's coming back. And his son, is Brian, is the bell player. He wow. took over for his dad as a bell player, and he did an absolutely excellent job. And I think that band has grown tremendously. It's another very their young, costumes, developing band. And yeah. their costumes were outstanding. Weren't they? they and the were yellow. They, they had a kind of a yellow theme because yes. of the backdrop, and all the suits were sucked right in. It was beautiful. Outstanding. Well said, gentlemen. And again, Bob, thank you very much. I know you've got more work to do outside because yep. you still are still a boss <laughs> with the string bands and the mummers. So keep that going. I want to thank you. Uh, and the Mummers Association in particular for the, the kind plaque and honor that uh, you folks gave me earlier in the year as well. That was very nice of you. Well deserved, sir, and uh, we want to thank you for doing everything that you do for us. And, Jake, uh, we always uh, think, think of you as the uh, horn player that should be a horn player and not a... Not <laughs> All right. A, not With a that, player. i got to hit those right. The Philadelphia years. String Band Association <laughs> show of shows, by the way, is February 27th. and never ends here. Noon to 5 p.m., uh, noon and 5 p.m., two shows at Boardwalk Hall in Atlantic City. Get your tickets at the Boardwalk Hall box office or call at Ticketmaster. Call toll-free 1-800-736-1420 or online at Ticketmaster.com. That's the String Band Association show of shows, February 27th in AC. More to come here now in the 2010 Comcast Mama's Parade as Mr. William Penn looks back from behind his head and looks down Broad Street at the rest of the string bands that are coming up. We've got a lot more to come, including our sixth band. Stay tuned, everybody. Just sign on and drive off. Mazda's drive-off event is back. Save huge on Mazda CX-7, Mazda 6, Mazda CX-9, and now lease the Mazda 3 with zero down payment, zero first month's payment, zero security deposit, and just $239 a month for 42 months. Hurry to Mazda's year-end drive-off event. Right now, lease the 2010 Mazda 3i Sport with zero first month's payment, zero due at lease signing, and just $239 a month for 42 months. Got the call late one night. She didn't say much, but I could tell the case would be extreme. The payout was big. A cool million, she said. <laughs> she wasn't lying. Extreme Green, the new instant game from the Pennsylvania Lottery. A little scratch and you could win one of five top prizes of a million dollars. I knew I'd never see her again. This case was closed. Keep on scratching. The highest quality ingredients make for a great broth. A great broth brings out the best in your dishes, and your dishes get the whole family together to share and connect. Collagen Broth, your recipe for goodness. For your next event, hire your favorite string band. Call 1-866-251-2638 or log on to phillymummers.com. Doesn't this look good? Enter to win a $2,000 tropical vacation by voting in the Mummers Viewer's Choice polls. Who's the best string band? The Fanciest Fancy Brigade. Text the name to 38807 or log on to myphl17.com slash vote. They get the bragging rights, you get the trip. The Comcast Mummers Parade Viewer's Choice Poll. Deadline for entry Sunday at midnight. I'm Eric Whitehead, a direct sales rep at Comcast, and we're proud to salute the troops and present their holiday greetings to friends and family back home. I'm Private Delgado. I'm in Afghanistan right now. I want to say hi to my mom and my little brother. Merry Christmas. I'm sorry I'm not there, but uh, 
I'll be there next year. For more troop greetings, check out the Get Local section of Comcast On Demand or watch them on Comcast.net. On behalf of all of us at Comcast, Happy New Year. <laughs> And welcome back to the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. I'm Jamison Euler, joined now by Aqua String Band Captain Ron Iannacone. He's joining us. Great performance out there. You guys are turning 90, something you're very proud of. Uh, we're extremely proud of it. In 2010, the Aqua String Band will be celebrating its 90th anniversary. Now, let's put that in perspective. The parade is 109 years old. We've been there for 90 years. And if I may say, this parade is for the people, by the people. We do it to make you happy. We need your support. Go to SaveTheMummers.com. Keep this amazing family-oriented tradition going. We do it for you. And in February, you're going to get a chance to see it. The show of shows in Atlantic City. Get your tickets. Go to Boardwalk Hall. And, you know, if I can just say to our home uh, neighborhood of Bridesburg, your Aqua String Band is going to be home in about an hour, hour and a half. We're going to celebrate <laughs> at Richmond and Orthodox. What a great day. And you know what? We're looking at some of your performance right there. How do you think you guys did there today? I, I got to tell you, there's no greater pride than being in a string band. Forget about even being the captain of a string band, just to be a part, be a part of this production, to be a part of sharing so many great memories with the people of Philadelphia every year. It's a beautiful thing. Well, you did Aqua Proud, 90 years, and going strong. Going strong. And you did great today. Thank, Thank you very you. much, Ron. Happy New Year. And Happy best New of luck year. to all the other bands coming up. Will do. Thanks a lot, Ron. Steve, back to you. Thank you, Jameson. And we do want to say Uptown String Band is getting ready to come up, and they're coming up to they're in position uh, they're just waiting for the starter to give them the cue we have a new captain for uptown string band ryan radcliffe and of course you see save the .com there and here we go this is la fiesta mexicana the theme ryan Clatt radcliffe starting now
Friday, tacos can turn into guitars. Beautiful, outstanding performance by Uptown String Band and brand new Captain Ryan Radcliffe, one of La Fiesta Mexicana. One of uh, four brand new captains, and you can see the new captains dance. This, that, that band came in fifth in music last year, and you can hear why. They had a, a very, very nice sax run in the middle of Malaguena. Difficult version of a cucaracha at the end. And I want to say one other thing about this band. There's a guy in this band named Russell Coleman. If you want to, you want to get my secrets and find out how I know everything about Mummers, <laughs> get on his website, yep. stringbandarchives.com, and you can become a mum freak just like me. And, and it's all Russ's work. Thank you. Thank you. Al Del Bono put the costumes together, but this is an in-house design. They design these things in-house. They work out in Humeville. They work at the firehouse. They're a great band, great people. Amanda, everybody, great job. You should be proud of yourselves. Really a great presentation. Dancing Borough loved it all. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a lot more of the string bands yet to come here on the 2010 Comcast Parade. And remember, you can take part in the voting you choose your favorite string band and later on this evening your fancy brigade that you think is the best of the night and you can vote and we will award the viewers choice award to each of those a string band and a fancy brigade you just go to myphl17.com or text the polls are open 5 p.m. for the string bands 8 p.m. tonight for the fancy brigades and of course when you do that, you're automatically registered to potentially win a $2,000 tropical vacation. Ladies and gentlemen, lots more of the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade to come. You're looking from high atop City Hall, eastward to the Delaware River and the Ben Franklin Bridge. This is the Comcast Mummers Parade, the string band division just getting underway. Stay tuned. Happy New Year, everyone. This year, MyPHL17 has one goal. I'm saving television, Lois. Because Family Guy is stronger than ever. Check out my bulging rippliness. Peter, you've been to the gym once for 15 minutes. Get tough in 2010 with Family Guy. Weeknights at 7.30 and 11 on MyPHL17. The costumes, the music, the magic. The Comcast Fancy Brigades tonight at 8, only on MyPHL17. The home of all things mummer. Vicky and Tina are BFFs. They texted earlier, agreed to meet at the Ford year-end sales event because they thought it might be fun. LOL. Now, FYI, Vicky is about to learn how much money she can save on a brand new Ford Escape with an EPA estimated 28 MPG. Her reaction? They're texting each other. Now get 0% financing for 60 months on a new Escape or lease for just $2.69 a month. Hurry, the year-end sales event ends January 4th. Starting now, I'm going to bring some fiscal sanity to our world. I'm going to find ways to spend less and save more. Starting now, I'm going to figure out what's ahead before I get there. All the guidance and resources you need to do the right thing financially. Make the switch. Starting now. Beneficial Bank. Starting now, I'm going to reach for higher places. The Mummers Show of Shows, February 27th at Boardwalk Hall. Order tickets at Ticketmaster.com or call this number. For more info, visit PhillyMummers.com. I'm Jeffrey Flood, customer care specialist at Comcast. And we're proud to salute the troops and present their holiday greetings to friends and family back home. This is Captain Andy Garcia from Camp Lindsay, Afghanistan. I just want to wish my parents, Annie and Sue Garcia, my brothers Matt and Chris, and my beautiful, lovely daughter Lillian, a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. For more troop greetings, check out the Get Local section of Comcast On Demand or watch them on Comcast.net. On behalf of all of us at Comcast, Happy New Year. And welcome back to the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. I'm Jameis Euler, joined now by the captain of the Uptown String Band, Ryan Radcliffe. Also joined by his father. This is your first year as captain. How'd you put it all together this year? Well, we got a great team, great production team. Everything's in-house, our music arranger, production, choreography, everything, props. So, uh, I mean, I got a great team to work with. We start right on January 2nd, practically, and start putting everything together. Real quickly here, tell me about your theme a little bit. Well, it's just a celebration of Mexico. 
you know, just little elements, you know, donkeys and carts and maracas and guitars, you know, we just wanted to have fun with it. Music's phenomenal, dancing's great, so it was a great element for us to work with. We know your dad, Ron, was in Uptown there for a while, joining along today, but, but not getting dressed up with the rest of the crowd, just joining along. Not getting dressed. All right, no. thanks a lot, guys. Steve, we'll send it back to you. All right, and also a shout out to Ed Armstrong Jr., 19-year-old, just returning from Air Force boot camp, but he's probably going to be shipped out right after uh, today. So we wish him the best uh, with up Uptown, and thanks for him doing that. This is the living, exciting, colorful 2010 edition of America's oldest folk parade, the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade, the longest continually televised live public event in the nation. We have Duffy String Band standing by with the ringmaster of this performance, Captain Ted Kudrick, their theme, Animal Crackers, starting now.
another tasty treat. Animal crackers from Duffy's String Band and Captain Ted Kudrick, Lucy the Elephant, lots of darling kids. That's great. Great job, Ted. Oh, they were wonderful. I, I love the way this band has advanced itself. There weren't too many years ago when they were what we call a bottom feeder, and now they're right up there, competitive as all get out. They, if you notice, one of the things they did that really impressed me, they took eight of their sax players and had them put those saxes on a, on, a bat, on a sax stand while they came out and danced. There was a time when Duffy couldn't have done that, and they didn't have that many good sax players, but they had enough that they could put eight of them back, and they were some of their best ones. This band is moving up like a skyrocket. Oh, they the really String are. Band Association this past year gave them the most improved band award. You can see why. And I'll tell you, the costuming was outstanding. Those elephant, eight elephant, large elephant suits that were out there. And the players who were animals had, even their feet was covered in the, in the corresponding fur. They didn't miss a detail. And all the facial makeup that they used, they just, and they ran a double theme. They had a theme that was both animals and a circus the circus run by the animals and they put it together and made one theme out of it. And a special thanks to Comcast for presenting the Mummers Parade this year. More to come on the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade as we look at the Delaware River here in Philadelphia and we enjoy an evening that is still got a little light in it and a lot more life in the Mummers Parade. I'm Steve Highsmith. Stay tuned everyone. Lots more to come. Happy New Year to you. Bottled cold, shipped cold, sold cold for cold fashion refreshments. Turkey Hill, America's number one refrigerated iced tea. Comcast brings Philadelphia the fastest 4G wireless network. 4G for faster shopping sprees, faster play-by-play -play updates, or something delicious, faster. 4G for faster presentation changes, faster work sessions, or meeting face-to-face, -face, faster. The company that brought you the fast home and office now brings you fast on the go with the fastest 4G wireless network. Ah, it's that special time of year again. When we start making our lists and checking them twice. For all the things that make the new Santa Fe, well, you know, really nice. Like great fuel economy in the city and on the highway. America's best warranty. And the peace of mind of Hyundai Assurance. All to make sure your commute is filled with comfort and joy. Now during Hyundai Holidays, buy a 2009 Santa Fe and get up to $2,500 cash back. For a copy of the Philadelphia String Band Association performances, send a check or money order to this address. For more info, log on to phillymummers.com. Nothing in this world just happens, Richard. Fate brought them together. This quest is bigger than any of us. Then you need me all the more. They are all that stands between the living. Everything he does is to save lives. And the living dead. There is no escape from death. Every episode, a thrill ride. Ah! Sunday at 8 on my PHL 17. Bottled cold, shipped cold, sold cold for cold fashion refreshments. Turkey Hill, America's number one refrigerated iced tea. And welcome back to the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. I'm Jamison Mueller, joined now by the Duffy String Band captain, Ted Kudrick, his son Jake joining us down here as well. How'd you guys do out there? I think we did beautiful. I think we did a great job today. Hold up the street, had fun. The band did everything they were supposed to. And I, 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 I want to thank them for the beautiful job they did all day today. In, in, including my, the marshals from music down to props. I want to thank everybody for a great job. I'll tell you what, everybody out here thought you did a great job. You certainly got enough applause out here as well. Congratulations, good luck, and with the uh, overall results. Thanks a lot, Ted. Steve, back to you. And now the band that answers the question, what happens when the Tidy Bowl man meets Durning String Band? Well, good, clean fun. It's Durning and Captain Joe Pamonte starting now.
Jesus and wow from the start when 84 year old Jimmy Buck got into the shower we'll talk about him in a moment you might say that was a sonitized version was, of do you was. think I'm sexy but you yeah know, he's still up there look at him going Jake he goes in the shower 84 year, 80 year old Jimmy Buck last year of John Travolta this year a shower and the guy playing the rubber ducky 66 year old Ray Bradis I watched that rehearsal the other night. Every time it came out of that shower, I started laughing. I want to tell you, the rubber ducky feet that they had, the oh, feet yeah. curler dancers, that was outstanding. The sax players in the shower stalls, it's amazing. And well, Jimmy Buck is such a story. He really He's owned the dry cleaners for 50 years that the Saget family, it's called Saget's Cleaners, had, and they're related to comedian Bob Saget. And Bob Saget loves the fact that Jimmy Buck carried on the name. Great guy, great band, always fun. They hit the mark. And they wanted me to uh, thank uh, some uh, members of the uh, Penn Sports String Band who volunteered their services to help them out this year. And uh, they they didn't need that much help, but they were better with the Penn Sport guys in there, too. And I, I tell you, it's a very, very funny theme. There's only one thing they missed. Heidi Ho, Gurney. <laughs> <laughs> and as they said to me, wait till you see Jimmy Buck naked. His uh, well, name was. is Jim <laughs> Buck <Kate and> Buck <laughs> Buckagian. <laughs> they call him Jimmy Buck. All right, folks, listen, we have a lot more of the string bands here. This is the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade, and Comcast On Demand provides choice, convenience, and control all from your remote. You can add 1-800-COMCAST to the end of the first in, uh, uh, of your life. Um, just keep on going, keep on watching that television, and when you want the best stuff, data, anything you want, 1-800-COMCAST. Stay tuned, everybody. It's your trusty sidekick, Philadelphia. Let's catch up. How about a cheesesteak and a game? Or we could check out the art museum. Then we can grab drinks and bust a move. Whew, that's quite a day. You should just stay over. And bring your friends and fam. Everyone can crash at one of my hotels for a few days. You're welcome. With love, Philadelphia. P.S. Come visit. I'm just a short drive away. Book your stay at gophila.com. The 2010 Mummers Show of Shows. One day only, two shows. And it all happens at the Atlantic City Boardwalk Hall, Saturday, February 27th at noon and 5 p.m. To order tickets, call 1-800-736-1420 or online at Ticketmaster.com. Special rates available for groups of 15 or more. It's the award-winning performances of the Philadelphia String Band Association, the 2010 Mummers Show of Shows. And don't forget, for all Mummers info, log on to PhillyMummers.com. Hello, I'm Ed McBride, External Affairs Manager for PICO. At PICO, we put our energy into beloved Philadelphia traditions like the Mummers Parade. Best wishes for a safe and happy holiday season. And this is the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. You're looking at the Acela Building in Philadelphia. This is America's oldest folk parade, and we're in for a clever performance now. One a little more serious than the other one we just saw. Re reveals are going to be fascinating in this. Tom Robeson is the captain. This is Woodland String Band. Phil Hard Magic is the theme, and they are starting now.
a magically delicious, awesome performance by Woodland String Band and Captain Tom Shaggy Robeson. They have had uh, nine straight finishes in the bottom half of the top ten, and most of the time it's been their costume. Well, their costume isn't going to hurt them this time. They are beautiful, and they some of those props, the invisible strings that made it look like... It looks like they were floating, floating, like they were levitating. It was outstanding. Oh, wonderful. And they also have the best percussion section on the street. And they had the walking wood blocks and the timpani drums and the chimes. And Harry Potter, outstanding performance. And folks, the Mummers work year-round. They just aren't here on New Year's Day, and they do a lot of charity work. And Woodland's a good example of that. Jim Wolfinger, Scott Greco, Mike Dingler, I saw, for example, at the recent Red Cross blood drive they held in their own clubhouse in October. And Tom Loomis. What a great sax player playing on the Bacon Brothers oh, yeah, song. Just a lot of good stuff. And these are just folks who have day jobs, but mummery is a hobby, a crazy one, they say. That is their tradition. They continue it forward. They spread joy and cheer on New Year's Day and throughout the year in Philadelphia. For all your mummerabilia or to make a donation, go to savethemummers.com at savethemummers.com, or you can call that number on your screen. And help continue. America's oldest folk parade and a great family and Philadelphia tradition. We have more of the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade coming up. Stay tuned, everybody. We are in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, in the heart of downtown or center city, and we are looking down as the parade winds its way through the city and here to City Hall. Getting ready next, we have another string band, Polish American, standing by. If you had a mouse in your home, you'd trap it. If you had bugs, you'd trap them. Well, you have things like dust mite debris, bacteria, pollen, and mold spores circulating in the air in your home. A Filtrate high-performance filter traps 90% of them. An ordinary filter, just 20%. 90 versus 20. It's your home. Make a resolution to change to a Filtrate filter and clean the air you breathe. The Comcast Mummers Parade is brought to you in part by Beneficial Bank, starting now. Starting now, I'm going to bring some fiscal sanity to our world. I'm going to find ways to spend less and save more. Starting now, I'm going to figure out what's ahead before I get there. All the guidance and resources you need to do the right thing financially. Make the switch. Starting now, Beneficial Bank. Starting now, I'm going to reach for higher places. For your next event, hire your favorite string band. Call 1-866-251-2638 or log on to phillymummers.com. He talks like a cop. You're under arrest. Works like an investigator. The jury never saw this. And works with a devil. You should see me in a blue dress. Vincent D'Onofrio, Catherine Irby, Chris Knopf, Law & Order Criminal Intent. Primetime Monday starting at 8 on MyPHL 17. Tonight at 10, get all the day's news plus the latest Earthwatch weather forecast in the 30-minute format that fits into your daily routine. It's all tonight on MyPHL 17 News at 10, powered by NBC 10. And you're looking down the beautiful Benjamin Franklin Parkway towards the Philadelphia Museum of Art along the Schuylkill River in Center City, Philadelphia, as we celebrate the new year, 2010, with the annual Mummers Parade. I'm Steve Highsmith, along with Jay Cart. Coming up, we have Polish-American String Band with Captain Mark Danielewicz. Their theme, the Joker's Ball. It's a nostalgia theme again, Jake. Black tie optional, but smiles are mandatory. And another traditional theme with everyone wearing a back piece and beautiful. The Joker's Ball, starting now.
in memory of Jimmy McGee, an outstanding performance, getting happy with Polish American String Band, releasing balloons, absolutely exquisite costuming, beautiful dance moves, 20 guys on benches. You know, I don't want to make predictions, but there's something very special about what we just saw. I mean, I think this band could very easily be in the top three when we're done. An old-fashioned mummer theme with very few props, gorgeous suits, good glockenspiel solos going into three-quarter time on happy days. Every good member dynamics, with back pieces. Everyone with back pieces, centered movement, and absolutely gorgeous. I mean, more beautiful because there weren't props. Loved it, loved it, loved it. Boy, you just said it best. It is one of those things where they themselves, what was inside them, the quality, the power of their play, and their individual performances brought together made that show happen. You didn't need the Broadway theater. You had it right there. It was outstanding well, by I Polish Americans. I hope I didn't American. jinx them, but boy, I said the Ray Daniel, Daniel Levitch this morning down on South Broad Street. I love this show when I saw it in rehearsal, and it's even better now. And we've got a lot more of the show to love, so stay tuned, everybody. Comcast, thank you very much for stepping up and continuing the Philadelphia tradition of the Mummers on television. Comcast making it happen. And you're looking right now at Boathouse Row along the Schuylkill River in Philadelphia, where many a fine regatta takes place, just behind the Museum of Art, and behind that is the zoo. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. This is the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. We are about a little more than halfway through the string band division. Coming up next, Hegeman String Band. Stay tuned, everybody. The costumes, the music, the magic. The fancy brigades are back on My PHL 17. Two hours, prime time, from the Pennsylvania Convention Center. The Comcast Fancy Brigades, tonight at 8, only on My PHL 17. Their job, get in, do not exist, get out, upstairs now, leave no trace, oh, they'll kill us all, trust nobody, this is a transcript of my wife, the unit, Wednesday starting at 8 on my PHL 17, game over boys, the Comcast Mummers Parade is brought to you in part by Pico, we put our energy into you, this is Susan, Susan is a saver, she saves loose change, leftovers, and even love notes from her husband, this is her husband, Barry. Barry had a long day. Oh. I'm awake. No, you're not. At Pico, we put our energy into helping Susan save with rebates, discounts, and energy-saving tips on our website. So Susan can save money, energy, and help the environment. And Barry can rest easy knowing this. Let it snow. Let it snow. Let it sleep, freeze, rain, and then let it snow again. Stabilitrack Stability Enhancement. Traction Control, plus a five-star crash safety rating. GMC Acadia. Now during the GMC Holiday Event, you can lease a 2010 GMC Acadia for $349 per month. See dealer for details. Visit GMCSuperDeals.com. The Mummer's Show of Shows, February 27th at Boardwalk Hall. Order tickets at Ticketmaster.com or call this number. For more info, visit phillymummers.com. Welcome back to the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. I'm Jamison Euler. Before we get to the next performance, joining me now is Polish American String Band Captain Mark Danielewicz. By the way, I must say, I just tried that hat on during the commercial break. I don't know how you walk around with something that's 15 pounds on your head. Yeah, I can't wait to get back to the bus and take it off. That's what I can't wait for. Well, you know what? I'm already hearing as you guys are coming off, people saying you guys just turned back the clock on Mummery there. That was a performance reminiscent of 25 years ago. Kudos to you guys. Oh, thank you. I mean, that's what we wanted to do. That was our goal. We wanted to go back to old time string band, plumes with everybody, getting the, uh, the, the Mummer umbrellas out there at the end. It was a fun theme. It was everybody knew the music. That's all. We wanted to entertain the crowd today, and we, I think we achieved that. Everybody says that everybody was cutting back a little bit on the costumes this year because of the economy, the economics of it all. You guys did not spare anything here. Well, we still had to cut back a little bit, but we did. We, we actually had to do some of the work ourselves in order for some of the cutback that we made on our suits, but we did. I, it was tough this year with the economy, but we tried our hardest. What was it like when you heard the crowd out there cheering you on as you guys were out there performing? You know, it, that's what it's about. It's about entertaining these people, entertaining our family and friends at home and everybody around. That's what New Year should be about. Mark, I think you guys did okay. When Good luck in the overall judging when all is said and done. All right, happy New Year. Happy New Year happy to you. Year. Gavin, Grace. All right. Steve, back to you. All right, we're getting ready for Hegeman String Band and Captain John Barron. He teaches at Gwynedd Mercy College and coaches basketball there. Their theme is clowning around town 
They are the winners of the 2009 Modes Creative Band Award with their theme last year of orchestrated oddballs. Now they're clowning around. Here's Hageman String Band starting now. Come into my funny door and we'll be jolly friends forevermore. Wow, Hageman, you've done it again. Captain John Barron, unique and innovative. That is Hageman. They are again. They are. And there's a theme that's been done a hundred times. Clowns never like this one. Never done as a city of clowns. They're not dressed as clowns. They have clown faces. They're dressed as businessmen, lawyers, doctors, firemen. It's an occupation theme. A city run by clowns. And by the way, if you're worried about the environment, 
they only let those balloons up a couple times all day and they kept a whole truckload of pre-filled balloons just to make sure they had enough of them. And it is a band that likes its entrances and one of the great starts to a performance because the crowd could not see the balloons to the last second, then the balloons were let go. And it was a beautiful start to their performance, which was even and active all the way through. Hegeman, outstanding and great striking colors. You talked about yellow in another group. Yeah. The yellow in this was outstanding. The taxi cab going through. The viewers are going to like that. And viewers, if Hegeman was your choice or any of the other bands you're seeing, Polish American or any of the others, this is your chance to weigh in. Starting at 5 o'clock tonight for the string bands, 8 o'clock for the fancy brigades. We will announce the results most likely next week. Doesn't a tropical vacation sound good too right now? Well, just by voting, you can automatically be registered to possibly win a $2,000 tropical vacation. It's the Comcast Viewer's Choice Poll, and that's for the string bands and for the fancy brigades. The string bands are on now. The fancy brigades will be coming up later. We also plan to rebroadcast part of the Bacon Brothers concert, of course, that we broadcast live when they came to help raise money for the Mommers back in December. This is the Comcast Mommers Parade. I'm Steve Highsmith, along with Judge Shakehart. We're live from Philadelphia, and we are in the string band division. More to come. Happy New Year, everybody. Comcast brings Philadelphia the fastest 4G wireless network. 4G for faster shopping sprees, faster play-by-play -play updates, or something delicious, faster. 4G for faster presentation changes, faster work sessions, or meeting face-to-face, -face faster. The company that brought you the fast home and office now brings you fast on the go with the fastest 4G wireless network. Best Disney movie since The Lion King is lighting up theaters everywhere. You mean? The Princess and the Frog is a wonderful musical gift. Play it, brother. Tell the people mama told you so. It's a start to finish delight. <laughs> One more time. And the film Time Magazine calls the best movie of the year. Thank you, thank you. Mm -hmm. Disney's The Princess and the Frog, rated G. You will enjoy. I guarantee. Now playing only in theaters. For a copy of the Philadelphia String Band Association performances, send a check or money order to this address. For more info, log on to fillingmummers.com. the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. I'm Jamison Euler, joined right now by the Hegeman Captain John, John Barron joining us. John, nice performance out there. Thank you very much, Jamison. It was a great time. It was a fun theme. I got to smile the whole time and wear this nose, so everyone on TV is probably laughing at this nose. No, everybody up in the stands actually likes the hat, likes the nose. I know. They want you to wear my nose and this hat. <laughs> Wait, put the hat on already. I don't know how you walk around with that. Thing. I didn't want to mess up your hair or anything. <laughs> this, this isn't moving, but I understand your kids are watching. Everybody. I do. JP, I love you. Jalen, I love you so much. They're 7 and 5. This one was for you, kids. I know. I told you this morning I was going to have a lot of fun for you, too. Thanks, babe. Looked like you had a lot I of fun out there. Fun. John, Happy New Year. Congratulations to you. Thanks, guys. Hey, me number one. Thank you. Thank you, Jameson, and we're getting ready for Greater Kensington String Band and Captain Jimmy Tater Jr. Jim Tater, first year as captain, Empire of the Czar, taking over from the great Scott Moyer. And here we go, GK, starting now.
performance has anyone rushing to the wow meter on that one. Perhaps the most challenging dancing that we've ever seen, certainly seen today. Difficult, difficult dance well, moves. This like band has great dancers in there. Captain Jimmy Tater is the guy I used to refer to as the Indian rubber man. If you saw him in the beginning of that routine, I never ever saw a captain full back piece leave both of his feet. That's amazing. I mean, that's isn't incredible. It? And and you got to give your hats off too to the lot, the front line dancers, the purple oh, and purple excellent. that were out there from and the start. They were outstanding. And they had a real ballerina up there, Jessica Kelly, dancing toe dancing on top of that Fabergé egg. Oh, that was a, a really exquisite part of the performance too. They had texture in this thing where they were energetic. They also lowered the dynamic. It was they really did. interesting. They, they, they lowered the dynamic very well. The good tempo slow down on Dr. Zhivago. And, you know, no one has done this theme since Quaker took first in 1999. And people thought, well, we can never do this again. Well, Greater Kensington decided we were going to do it again. They did it differently than Quaker. They did it exquisitely. And I think they're going to be right in there in the mix. It's a, it's a, this point where we always say, it, because it's true, it's very difficult to be a judge because you see how different each of these performances is and at the same time how excellently executed they are. And for those who are not familiar with the Mummers, who are tuning in for the first time, these are not professionals out there. These are people in your everyday walk of life. They're salespeople, doctors, accountants. They do all kinds of things. They're plumbers, they work in retail. They work throughout the year for this day and to do charity work throughout the year. These are the Mummers. These are Philadelphia. They date back to the late 16, mid 1600s. And the formal parade started 110 years ago. So this is really quite, quite a day for Philadelphia to herald in the new year in only the fashion that the Mummers can. If now, you know, we do have some results. I must say there are five divisions. We're only in the string band division right now. The comic division, we do have the top prize winners to announce. The 210, the 2010 order of finish is Murray. Murray winning 12, a record, 12 first prizes in a row. And a hat off to also Dennis Pellegrino of Murray for taking first prize captain. And the brigade went to Dancing with the Czars. Ironically, another Russian theme. Landy, you uh, did very well. You got uh, for the Jetson zooming uh, in the new year. We uh, Hats off to you. There's Dennis in the order of finish. Uh, Dennis and Mike and Rob Sikowski there in that order. Winch Brigade, first prize went to Bryson's for their pop secret garden. And that's the first division that we saw up the street today. That is the comic division. They were followed by the fancies. Now we're in the string band division. The fancy brigades are coming later. And of course, the winch brigade division was between the comics and the fancies. And the fancy brigades, which is the last division up the street, will actually be also on television from the Pennsylvania Convention Center. They do two performances indoors. The Fancy Brigade finale, you'll see that right here as well. We are here at the 2010 Mummers Parade, the Comcast Mummers Parade, live in Center City, Philadelphia. We're coming your way with a lot more of the string bands. You just saw Greater Kensington. We've got South Philadelphia string bands straight ahead. Stay tuned, everybody. Hope your new year is going well. Doesn't this look good? Enter to win a $2,000 tropical vacation by voting in the Mummers Viewers' Choice polls. Who's the best string band? The fanciest Fancy Brigade. Text the name to 38807 or log on to myphl17.com slash vote. They get the bragging rights, you get the trip. The Comcast Mummers Parade Viewers' Choice Poll. Deadline for entry Sunday at midnight. MyPHL17 News at 10. The number one 30-minute news at 10. Starting now, I'm going to bring some fiscal sanity to our world. I'm going to find ways to spend less and save more. Starting now, I'm going to figure out what's ahead before I get there. All the guidance and resources you need to do the right thing financially. Make the switch. Starting now. Beneficial Bank. Starting now, I'm going to reach for higher places. The 2010 Mummers Show of Shows. One day only, two shows. And it all happens at the Atlantic City Boardwalk Hall, Saturday, February 27th at noon at 5 p.m. To order tickets, call 1-800-736-1420 or online at Ticketmaster.com. Special rates available for groups of 15 or more. It's the award-winning performances of the Philadelphia String Band Association, the 2010 Mummers Show of Shows. And don't forget, for all Mummers info, log on to PhillyMummers.com. 
I'm Steve Highsmith. Great parade underway. And with me is Mark Ruggieri of Cadillac. Happy New Year to you, Mark. Happy New Year. And to all the Cadillac dealers in the area as well. You represent a large area from Wilmington up to Kutztown, the Jersey Shore over to Lancaster. All the Cadillac dealers opening their houses and welcoming everybody in right now? Yes, this is our season's best event running through January 4th. Well, it's great that you can support the parade. We appreciate that. Well, we're happy to be partnering with the great Philadelphia tradition, finally. The SRX, is that doing pretty well this year? SRX is jumping off a lot. I've never seen anything hotter. How are leases? Are the leases back? And we're back in the leasing business, and the leasing deals are the greatest we've had. Now, I know you want to make a special mention to some folks who are enjoying this parade. It's made possible, really, because of their sacrifices. Yes, we don't want to forget our ladies and gentlemen that serve in the armed forces and helping us be able to live our lives day in and day out. Mark, I want to thank you very much, all the Cadillac dealers in the area. Thank you very much. Happiest of 2010. Steve. More of the parade coming up. Stay tuned, everybody. You're watching My PHL 17. Welcome back to the 2010 Comcast Bummers Parade. I'm Jamison Yoler. Before we get to the next performance, let's talk about the performance that just happened with the Greater Kensington String Band. Joining me now is Captain Jim Tater Jr. How you doing? How, how about uh, how about that performance out there by you guys? Oh, it was great. All the way up the street. We had a great day. The, the concept and the theme, where did it come up? Where did it come from? Uh, it's something we've been tossing around for a while. We build on it and build on it over time, and we finally figured it was ready, ready to be pulled back out of the hat since uh, Quaker City did it uh, back in 98, I believe. So we figure nobody's done it yet, so we're, we're going to attempt it. All right, Jim, because the, uh, the crowd here is telling me I've got to wear this hat. Wear we'll, go, hat. we'll send it back to Steve as I put the hat on. Oh, yeah, the crowd's happy. The crowd is happy. And we're not going to see the hat? Oh, well. All right, South Philadelphia String Band is next here. They are preset. They are just about ready to go. This is Captain Denny Palandro, a gathering of nations in memory of Jim Passio. It's going to be an effort to get him in the Hall of Fame, by the way. Gathering of nations. Here we go. South Philadelphia String Band starting now.
magnificent. Wow. I would call that a stampede of delight. I tell you, talk about South Philadelphia string band, Jake. You talk about energy. This was spirit of the tribe. And that great banjo reveal in the they buffalo. Under the buffalo. With the, they not only had a buffalo, they had a, a picture painted on the buffalo. And they are the king of props, no question about it. One of the things I liked that they did, you notice they had a bunch of guys dressed with um, brown feathers on their the top of their heads, the dog warriors. That's where they put their strongest saxophone players at them, right in the middle. And they have a, a terrific sax section, but to take those guys in the middle, it just blasts that sound right out at you. And they start from the start, from the get-go, being energetic, but you think that they're at a high level, and they just keep raising the level, and the detail, the totem poles in the back, the live people who came to the top of the totem poles, well, right, they, right about the time the Thunderbird came up. I talked to Denny Palandro about this, and. The last five bands this year are the top five from last year. He's the first of them. And he said to me, we know we're the first of that group of five, and we want to be up there with them, so we have to overwhelm the judges because we're number one. Well, they did. <laughs> we'll see what happens. We have more of the 2010 Comcast Parade to come. Now, the String Band Show of Shows is something else that also takes place each year. The Philadelphia String Band Association Show of Shows is February 27th. That's at noon and 5 p.m. Two shows at Boardwalk Hall in Atlantic City, New Jersey. Get your tickets at Boardwalk Hall box office or call Ticketmaster. Toll free 1-800-736-1420 and go online at Ticketmaster.com. We've got a lot more to come here with the string band division. We have four more bands. Next, Avalon, followed by Quaker City, then by reigning champions Freylinger, followed by Furco String Band. Wait till you see these four. Stay tuned, everybody. As you look from City Hall to the Pennsylvania Convention Center and beyond to the northeast of the Delaware River, this is the Comcast Mummers Parade on, well, right here, my PHL 17. This is an exciting time. Stay tuned. Lots more to come. Can't wait to see what the judges do. For your next event, hire your favorite string band. Call 1-866-251-2638 or log on to phillymummers.com. The Comcast Mummers Parade is brought to you in part by Turkey Hill. Bottled cold, shipped cold, sold cold for cold fashion refreshments. Turkey Hill, America's number one refrigerated iced tea. Comcast brings Philadelphia the fastest 4G wireless network. 4G for faster shopping sprees, faster play-by-play -play updates, or something delicious, faster. 4G for faster presentation changes, faster work sessions, or meeting face-to-face, -face faster. The company that brought you the fast home and office now brings you fast on the go with the fastest 4G wireless network. They are an elite counterterrorism force bound by secrecy. We know the rules. And guided by honor. I've been talking in bed, soldier. With a measure of a job well done, is no one ever knows. Does not exist. Dennis Haysbert. I got a mission going down the drain. They'll kill us all. Boom. I'm shutting you down. Scott Foley. I ain't your soldier. We got her. Holy hell. The critically acclaimed series. Mommy. The Unit. Daughter just sold you out. Two hours. Wednesday starting at 8. Game over, boys. On my PHL 17. Bottled cold, shipped cold, sold cold for cold fashion refreshments. Turkey Hill, America's number one refrigerated iced tea. Welcome back to the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. I'm Jamison Euler, joined now by South Philadelphia String Band Captain Denny Palandro. Denny, great performance out there. You know what? The crowd's been calling for me to wear headdresses all day long. So I got to put this on as I do the interview. You got it. <laughs> there you go. You're good? You want the wig too? There you go. You got the wig. Give him the wig. You came in third last year. How do you top that performance? Uh, we're trying every year. We're trying to improve our music, we're trying to put out a good quality suit and our presentation. We have, I think, the best prop builders in the business and a uh, great presentation director, great musical director. We work really hard and hopefully we'll, we'll, we'll stay in that competitive range and maybe move a little higher. Congratulations, Danny. Good luck to you out Thank there. You, Steve, I'm going to uh, I'm going to send this up to the booth for you. This is going to look good on you, buddy. 
Well, you know what? I think it looks great on you. I will accept it. I'm wearing beads Pierre Robert gave me today. So, you know, I'm, I'm into the spirit. Now, here we have Avalon String Band and the great Captain Jack Key, and the theme is Prairie Tales. This is really going to be one of the best ones that you see here today. This is always a band that really goes into detail about whatever theme they're doing. So here's Avalon String Band starting now.
definitely kicking them up and riding high. Six Gun Greatness from Avalon String Band, you know, Prairie Tales, and Captain Jack He. It's hard for me to be neutral about this band. I was a member of them for 20 years, but there's no question they're right up there in the leaders, and, and they're a model of consistency. This band has spent 26 years in the top 10. The only two bands who have a longer streak than that is Quaker City and Furco, not even Frailinger. Mm -hmm. So this band can do it, and they can do it every year. I talked at the beginning about detail, and one of the things that you'll find with this, did you notice the bow-legged chaps effect? Oh, I love the bow-legged chaps. And, and there's the, they put a train in there. You're going to see some more trains. I want to mention that the, the music director of this band is Jimmy Crompton, mm -hmm. Jerry's son. This is his third year as music director, when he's only 26 years old. So where is he going to be in 10 more years? <laughs> He'll be doing stuff for the Philadelphia Orchestra. And you mentioned that train. That space that Jack had to dance oh. on up top was so small that really you have to be athletic as well to be able to handle that. That's not necessarily safe being up there if you, you don't know what you're doing. You not enough to do that. There's no, there's no guardrail up there. And you saw how high it was, and he's up there dancing on it. Well, I, I, I want to tell you, SaveTheMummers.com is something that uh, we would like you to go to and spend your time. And if you have a dime or two to share with the Mummers and the rest of us to keep this tradition going, that would be great. SaveTheMummers.com, or you can see the phone number there that you can go to as well. And don't forget, not only do we have the Fancy Brigade finale coming up later in the evening, no. but in between the time, we have the Bacon Brothers concert. And that was a fundraising concert. So during that, too, if you have the spirit, please do what you can. Let's save the Mummers. SaveTheMummers.com. And more to come here on the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. I'm Steve Highsmith along with Jake Hart. We've been here for the comics. We've been here for the fancies, the winch brigades. We've been here now for the string bands and the fancy brigade finale coming up. Stay tuned, everybody. You're looking at the Comcast Tower and Liberty and everything else in Center City, Philadelphia. Stay tuned. Comcast Mummers Parade is brought to you in part by your Tri-State Toyota dealers. Time's running out on Toyotathon, our biggest event of the year. <laughs> Hurry in for amazing deals on a huge selection of your favorite Toyota models. And right now at your neighborhood Toyota dealer, you can lease a safe and reliable new 2010 Toyota Sienna for just $2.59 a month. Or choose the versatile new 2010 Toyota Highlander and get a $2.79 a month lease. It's not just an event, it's Toyotathon, on now through January 4th. They say the dollar's weak. Well, it's about to get stronger. Because Planet Fitness is having their $1 sale. Between now and January 8th, sign up at Planet Fitness for only a dollar, then pay just $10 a month. It's the best way to stay healthy and keep your bank account healthy, too. So skip the muscle head gyms and for one week only, starting January 1st, join Planet Fitness for a dollar, then pay just $10 a month with no commitment. Only at Planet Fitness, home of the judgment-free zone. The highest quality ingredients make for a great broth. A great broth brings out the best in your dishes, and your dishes get the whole family together to share and connect. Collagen Broth, your recipe for goodness. And you're looking live from high atop City Hall in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, down our Champs-Élysées of the United States, Benjamin Franklin Parkway in Philadelphia, towards the Museum of Art, the Schuylkill River in the distance, the Comcast Tower to the left. This is the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. I'm Steve Highsmith, along with Jake Hart. We have next Quaker City String Band, one of the legendary bands in string bands, and Captain Charlie Rhodes in his second year. He is first prize-winning captain in his first year last year. And one of the great titles this year that is a finalist for the Custard's Last Stand oh, Award yes. for most interesting theme title, Mums of La Mancha. Now, seriously, though, <laughs> Jake, this is a distinguished, layered, and textured theme that we're going to see here. It is. And here we go. This is Quaker City starting now.
a font of fabulousness, a rose with no thorns in that performance, and a captain's reappearance, Jake, that was almost magical on that fountain. They really were. You know, you listen to the music of this band. If you're into this Spanish music, you get to the end of that routine, and they're playing Cumana and El Cumachero, and they're playing them at the same time. And you think, what tune is that? Well, the answer is it's both tunes, and that takes tremendous talent and arranging skills for any worthwhile who does their music. You know, what can I tell you? They, they can play as well as anybody, and, and their costumes were beautiful. It was a serious Spanish scene. No matadors, no bullfights. A little bit off of their traditional comic style, but exceptionally well done. Yeah, nothing funny about that performance. It but, was really entertaining. Yeah, oh, yeah. And Charlie pumping that sword at the end there. Another they one know climbing they did a great up job. high on something and running around on it. Oh, a couple of times he did that. The fountain yeah. reappearance itself, I thought, was outstanding. And just how they worked that whole choreography out was really something. And, you know, Frank Rothwine, who's the music director, said to me, Steve, the emotion of going up the street. These folks down, start down at Broad and Oregon and come up a couple miles here to City Hall. He said it's something that just builds as you get closer to the hall where the judging takes place, where the TV cameras are and the crowd, your feet off the crowd, and that keeps going. And you wonder what you're going to do when you actually get here. Are you going to be able to control the energy? Are you going to remember everything you're supposed to remember? You've got a sheet here. You, you hold know, that I up. I know we can't get up. a good camera this, shot. This is an example this of is what from these another bands, band. It's not, it's not this. It happens to be Uptown. Mm -hmm. They have a, a diagram for every single part of the routine. And if you can see this thing up close, they're all numbered. This is not easy stuff. They're not running around out there having, a, <laughs> you know, having fun. These are serious drills and routines done in those costumes while playing that music. And anyone who thinks this isn't hard to do, you ought to try it. I tried it for 25 years. Oh, you did okay. And it was always hard to do. <laughs> well, we want to thank Quaker City for another fine performance. We have Freylinger and Furco coming up, two of the other great bands, and Freylinger trying to win eight in a row. And I want to remind you that even though the parade will be ending today, there is at least one more opportunity in the near future to see your favorite string bands. The Philadelphia String Band Association Show of Shows is February 27th. There's a noon show and a 5 p.m. show at Boardwalk Hall in Atlantic City, New Jersey. Get your tickets at the Boardwalk Hall box office or at Ticketmaster locations. You can call toll-free at 1-800-736-1420 or online at Ticketmaster.com. We're in Center City, Philadelphia. This is New Year's Day 2010. I'm Steve Heinsmith along with Jake Hart. We're in the string band division. Freylinger and Perko still ahead. Happy New Year, everyone. Stay tuned. Of all the holidays, this is the season of sharing, when even the smallest gesture can bring warmth to your heart. So in the spirit of giving, Hyundai is spreading a little extra comfort and joy. Buy a 2010 Sonata and you'll get 0% financing for up to 60 months and make no payments for 90 days. Plus, you'll get America's best warranty and Hyundai Assurance. See? You're not that hard to shop for. Get 0% financing for 60 months on the 2010 Sonata. Ends January 4th. For a copy of the Philadelphia String Band Association performances, send a check or money order to this address. For more info, log on to fillingmummers.com. The concert event that helped put the Mummers on Broad Street. Don't want to waste another day. Comcast presents the Bacon Brothers, A Night with the Mummers. Encore presentation today after the parade on MyPHL 17. Hi, I'm Sam Kuhn, Customer Care Specialist at Comcast, and we're proud to salute the troops and present their holiday greetings to friends and family back home. I'm A1C Gary Williams here in uh, 407 AEG Iraq. I'm sending these out to my family back in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Um, I'll say, say hi and happy holidays to my mom, my dad, my brother-in-law, my sister, who just had a baby girl, and by the time we reach this, she'll probably be a few months old. And my other niece, Alyssa, and my girlfriend, Tamara. Happy holidays, guys, and I love you. For more Troops greetings, check out the Get Local section on Comcast On Demand or watch them on Comcast.net. On behalf of all of us at Comcast, Happy New Year. And we're back with the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. Ladies and gentlemen, get yourself set for what is sure to be a powerful and thrilling performance. This is the Freylinger String Band, reigning champions, Captain Thomas D'Amour in his first year as captain, new co-directors, drill directors, Joe Ferry, 
Jack Mills. This is Fraylor just feuding, fussing, and fighting starting now. Mount Everest performance. Jake, I'm going to have to watch that 20 times to figure out everything that was going on in there. Well, just start with the music. You know, th their transitions are not just turnstiles from one tune to another. Their transitions are part of the music. When they went from Wabash Cannonball into Mountain Dew, when they went from Beverly Hillbillies into Tennessee Waltz, the movement into the theme was just as good as the song. And the way they ended that Tennessee Waltz with that forte piano out of nowhere, this music is... I love it when you talk it's that so way. It's so difficult. <laughs> oh, well, you know. 
it, this you man can't knows help his it, music. He can play this jazz. Stuff. He can play everything. The I Tennessee but not waltz, like though, those guys. When, <laughs> when you are in that powerful frame of mind where you're moving, you're moving, you're moving, and then all of a sudden you put on the brakes and you, in a controlled fashion, play with such beauty That's, and then have to kick it back in again. Oh, it's as, amazing as, to me. As Bill Gartner who teaches in their music says, it said in the paper the other day, you turn notes into music and that's exactly what and by the way does. billy we wish you you know speedy recovery and, and everything well yeah. and you know, i wrote down a couple of notes here the, the the detail in this the sides of the fiddles that had the check pattern you notice when the train arrived each time they made sure smoke came out to give again the impression that it's coming perfect. to a halt Every, they you know, didn't miss a trick they may win eight in a row uh, well i think this year they may have some more competition than they've had in the past it wouldn't shock me a bit if they won eight in a row, but there were so many good bands and we haven't even seen the last one yet. Well, I think also, and that's a good point, Furco coming up, but with Freilinger, not only have they won seven in a row and they had a great captain in Bill Bowen and in a presentation director, Mike Rare, who have continued on as advisors, but basically they turned over to a younger generation, including 21-year-old Thomas D. Amore, the oh, captain. Yeah. What is this big franchise? And you have a lot of good members. Don't forget that. It's the foundation. All the members of the foundation. But there's a lot of pressure on these folks, and they deliver today. Thomas, by the way, is a Comcast employee, and he loves Frank Sinatra. He likes the Beatles. He likes Dave Matthews. He likes Bobby Darin. He's just a, a fun guy, and he's handled the pressure really well. And I ought to also mention their, their arranger, John Renega, yeah. who, if he isn't the, the genius of arrangers, <laughs> In all of string bands, I don't know who is. Well, we're waiting for Furco to, to get lined up here. I just want to give you another mention. The Bacon Brothers concert is coming up in just a few minutes. Also, the Fancy Brigade finale will follow after that. And we have more. There you go, the Bacon Brothers concert. And we have more coming up on the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade with the string band that will be bringing it home. Furco string band with what will be an excellent performance. And so you've seen a bunch. And don't of forget when they're done, we're going to give out our trophy. That's right, Custard's so last stand. I have it here, ready to show. All right, and uh, we have to do some quick uh, putting our head together. Yes, we do. All right. Well, during this break, we're going to put our heads together. Furco's getting ready. Stay tuned, everybody. More of the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade yet to come here on My PHL 17. Stay tuned, everyone. Oh, not yet, Frank. Not yet. Frank knows the Ford year-end sales event is almost over. Almost. There's still time, though, for great deals and leases on cars, trucks, SUVs, crossovers, fuel-efficient vehicles just waiting to be driven home. Come on. You know you want one. What are you waiting for? Invitation? Here's one. Now lease a new Edge for just $2.89 a month or get 0% financing for 60 months on a new Edge. Hurry. The year-end sales event ends January 4th. Comcast brings Philadelphia the fastest 4G wireless network. 4G for faster shopping sprees, faster play-by-play -play updates, or something delicious, faster. 4G for faster presentation changes, faster work sessions, or meeting face-to-face, -face, faster. The company that brought you the fast home and office now brings you fast on the go with the fastest 4G wireless network. The Mummer's Show of Shows, February 27th at Boardwalk Hall. Order tickets at Ticketmaster.com or call this number. For more info, visit PhillyMummers.com. TV's biggest hit, Philadelphia's number one comedy at 6.30 and 7. Please don't hit on her. Hit on who? Taylor's mom. Why would I hit on Taylor's mom? Well, because she's kind of pretty and you'll hit on anything with a pulse. Philly's number one comedy, Two and a Half Men, weeknights at 6.30 and 7 on MyPHL 17. So you won't hit on her? Absolutely not. Hi, I'm Taylor's mom. <laughs> Scratch that. The Comcast Mummers Parade is brought to you in part by GMC. Let it snow. Let it snow. 
let it sleep, freeze, rain, and then let it snow again. Stabilitrack Stability Enhancement, traction control, plus a five-star crash safety rating. GMC Acadia. Now during the GMC Holiday Event, you can lease a 2010 GMC Acadia for $349 per month. See dealer for details. Visit GMCSuperDeals.com. Starting now, I'm going to bring some fiscal sanity to our world. I'm going to find ways to spend less and save more. Starting now, I'm going to figure out what's ahead before I get there. All the guidance and resources you need to do the right thing financially. Make the switch. Starting now. Beneficial Bank. Starting now, I'm going to reach for higher places. And you're looking at the top of the tallest building in Philadelphia, the Comcast Tower. On the 110th anniversary of the first official Mummers Parade, this is the 2010 Comcast Mummers Parade. And we're at the final string band. It's the Joseph A. Furco string band, Captain Anthony Salenza, and continuing and ending with a theme that's been all day, nostalgia. This is Hobo Junction starting now.
boxcar performance that came off boxcars. They mopped up with that performance. Great job, Captain Anthony Salenza. I tell you, not only is Furco one of the legendary bands, not only did they live up to who Furco is, but they have made it the parade to remember. They, Braylinger, Quaker City, Avalon, Polish American, go down the list. Excellent performances well, that, today, up know, and down the line. But let's talk about we're, Furco. We we're saw not even start with that one. I mean, a perfect example of how to arrange standard mummer songs and make them sound original. And at the end, the sax player is playing with one hand while dancing with the other. That's very, very hard to do. The longest banjo accordion solo on the street with the best probably banjo accordion section on the street. Everything about them, again, this is a band that's right up there every year and for proper reason. It's, it's a very, very difficult parade, once again, to try to decide who's going to come in first. It's a, a bundle of a performance complete with bindles. Bindles, that's right. Those are the, the sacks that are on the end of the bindles mm -hmm. at the end. And that's what they call those th the things the hobos carry over their shoulder, bindles. Yep. I never knew that. And, you know, one of the things that, that I liked about this performance, too, is that it really bookended well the outdoor portion of the parade because in the comic division there were a number of references to nostalgia, a number of references to the hard times a lot of people have had over the last couple of years. And whenever that happens, not only does entertainment increase its value and it becomes necessary, but a lot of times you hearken back to times when things were harder before and the things that you remember or that you read about or that got you through those times. And in this one, case there was a hearkening back to the depression era and the hobo era that was there and there were so many bands this year who were doing these traditional themes and and i think that you know i think we want to go back to tradition i think this whole country wants to go back to tradition greater overbrook string band greater started overbrook it all off starting it off with that that looking back theme and and furco ending mm -hmm. it up with a a real traditional uh hobo theme that's been done for years by new bands just mm -hmm. starting out because they can make a cheap suit, but you can also make an expensive suit yes. and do it magnificently fancy like Freco did. And Polish American with all the back pieces Polish for American, every member with Joker's Ball, another out outstanding I, you know, one. Which is, by the way, if you notice, uh, SaveTheMummers.com, we're here, we're all here because we love the Mummers and we love what the Mummers has meant to Philadelphia. They are great ambassadors for this city. They help so many people throughout the year. They're mentors to young people. They visit senior citizens. They go up and down the line to a person they have contributed to this community. We want to encourage you to go to SaveTheMummers.com. We also want to encourage you to stay tuned. We have the Bacon Brothers concert, and we also have the Fancy Brigade's finale. The, the Fancy Brigade's scheduled to air about 8 o'clock tonight on my PHL 17. And one of the things, you know, we talk about mummer imagery you know that tom quinn the director had new year parade he's got the movie out there that's been winning awards left and right people around the nation are learning more and more about the mummers what they mean to the city how far back they go the integrity of that family tradition and what it means just in terms of making people smile and if you like what you saw here you have a favorite string band you have a favorite fancy brigade that you're going to be seeing later on this evening you get a chance to vote and we That's will right. award a viewer's choice poll yeah, and uh, you might even get a tropical vacation to boot and it's a two thousand dollar vacation and you basically do it very easily go to myphl17.com right away you'll see how to get to where you need to go you can also text and the polls are just about open they'll open at five o'clock for the string bands they'll open at eight o'clock tonight for the fancy brigades and those polls will stay open through sunday night about 11 59 midnight or so so take part in that and of course we'll award those trophies probably next week now let's now, talk about we trophies. have a trophy to give right now this is the custer slant stand custer trophy Slash stand award and it's sort of like the stanley cup all the winners best themed title are engraved on the front and the winner this year will get their name on the bottom and they'll be able to have this trophy in their club for one year now let's go over our nominees. Well, before that, I just want to right. give people an idea. 2003 was the first one, Woodland's Arg. 2004, Aqua Jailhouse Flock. 2005, Woodland, How the West Was Mum. South Philadelphia, then that's Entertainment. Aqua, Rated Arg. And Polish-American Ghouls Gone Wild and then in last 2008. last year, Durning was Saturday Fright Fever. And so, and the winner, year, Judge well, Jake here, Hart. Here are the five finalists. Oh, okay. Irish-American, Wasting Away in Mummeritaville. Aqua, It's About Time. Journey, Good Clean Fun, Avalon, Prairie Tales, and Quaker, The Mums of La Mancha. All and right. This year's winner, the Custard's Last Stand Award, goes to the Quaker City String Band for Mums, Mums of, of La, La Mancha. Mancha. And after it's engraved, <laughs> Steve and I will be down to their club to present it to them. 
And Congratulations, Quaker City. And it has become the uh, best-known prize in all of Mumford. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> At any rate, ladies and gentlemen, that concludes our outdoor portion of our parade. Don't forget to stay tuned for the Bacon Brothers and for the Fancy Brigade finale. I want to give my thanks to all the people who have helped us today. There are so many people who have been working for weeks and months to put this parade on and out here today. Can't name most of them, obviously, but all the crew of PMTV, led by Rob Schmall, our executive producer, Liz Naughton, Bob Bieber, producer in the booth, Mike Tully, who's the director. I want to thank Rosemary Connors and Ron Goldwyn and, of course, Jake Hart. Judge, thank you very much. It's Lori Wilson, pleasure. Denise Nakano, Aditi Roy, Jamison Euler, and our vice president and general manager at MyPHL17, Vince Giannini. Thank you all very much. Have the best of New Year's. Have a wonderful 2010, and thanks for the mummeries. Good night. Good night. Okay. Second.